Hey, what's up everybody? I was looking back at my TSX oil change video and I noticed that I never addressed whether to check the engine oil when the engine is warm or cold. So I want to cover this in this video. About 20 years ago when I got my first car, people would tell me to check my oil level in the morning when the engine is cold. Even Scotty Kilmer, a YouTuber that I admire, has said many times in his videos to check the oil level first thing in the morning when the engine is cold. So let's find out if you should check the oil level on a cold engine or a warm engine. Here I have the manuals for both my 2005 Acura TSX and my girl's 2017 Toyota RAV4. The Acura manual says to run the engine for several minutes, then turn off the engine and let it sit for several minutes, then check the oil level. So pretty much check it on the warm engine. The Toyota manual says to warm up the engine, turn off the engine, let it sit for 5 minutes, and then check the oil level. I also noticed that the Toyota manual says that the oil level is considered to be excessive at the upper level mark. So both my TSX manual and my RAV4 manual say to check the engine oil when the engine is warm. This is why it's important to pay attention to your owner's manual. So the answer for your car is going to be in your owner's manual. If you don't have it, look for it online. So let's see how much the reading is off on the dipstick if I check it cold. Just a reminder, when checking the oil level, first pull out the dipstick, then wipe it clean with a paper towel. Next, fully insert it, and finally, you want to pull the dipstick back out and check the oil level. Here is the level when I checked it cold. I ran the engine for 5 minutes and then let it cool down for 5 minutes. Here is the level when I checked it warm. I want you to note that I usually aim for the middle of the dipstick when I refill my engine oil. Anyways, my understanding is that it's about one quart of oil from the lower marking to the upper marking on the dipstick. So checking it cold would miss the mark by about half a quart. The last thing I want to remind you of is that the most important thing you can do to make your engine last long is change your engine oil regularly. I like what Scotty says. He says oil is cheap and engines are expensive. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave your questions in the comment section, and I'll see you in the next one.